hello everyone this is asm arif today welcoming you to my photoshop tutorial this one is a new tutorial and uh, uh, today i'll work with the brush tools of photoshop and uh, make a creative brush shapes or the uh, effect in a portrait mode okay let's go to the fill file and take a new uh, at first i'll take a new custom uh, canvas uh, which is uh, with these uh, 2560 and the height is uh, 1440 and the resolution could be uh, 300 dpi or pixel per inch you can give it the pixel per centimeter but i'll give the pixel per inch and hit the create button a new canvas will appear on your screen and then go to the file and open up any portrait if you want to open up um, that or apply the effect on your portrait suppose I will take this portrait okay this one is a portrait of a uh, omen and I downloaded this portrait from the pixiebay.com I will give you the download link of this image for um, this image you can um, go to my video description and you will get the download link okay I will drag and drop this photo by the that means this one is my photo and here is uh, our uh, the black and uh, white canvas blank canvas and press ctrl t for transform and resize the photo okay then resize the photo make it a smaller size okay hit okay and after that i'll make it mask and make it reverse mask okay reverse mask when this one is black make it white and take the brush tool go to the brush tool and take the brush from your brush palette and I will also give the brush in the download link in my video description so don't forget to check out the video description and don't forget to subscribe my channel just because of uh, all the project um, in a previous project I have given all the stock images and the, all the brush links if you don't want to miss that one you have to subscribe my channel and uh, for the new thing okay no more talk okay then I'll take this brush and this one is the brush I'll just reduce the brush size by pressing the third bracket opening and hit ok just the okay after that take uh, take this brush and increase the brush size okay after that take another brush this one this one is good you can increase the decrease in the brush size I'm pressing Ctrl Z uh, because of which just give the brush like that. Okay, making it smaller. After that, take this brush, place over the face. Okay, uh, take another brush like that. here and there also take this spot brush and make it smaller okay after that take a new layer and select this color from the image and just press over there okay and take this color and take another brush from here give this okay and after that take another brush which is this brush randomly you can this give this brush over there and 
take another layer and give take this brush and just give some brush like skin color like that slightly you can apply otherwise this will be okay another brush make it smaller okay take the pink color or red color from the lips and just select this layer and give here make it smaller okay good and take another brush like this this one and make it smaller and just place over there okay that's good and take another new layer and just take this brush and take the first brush one and press the press one time and make it skin blending mode skin and reduce the opacity of the eyes okay after that take another brush and take the cyan color and just press over there and also make the blending mode skin and reduce the opacity you can reduce the opacity of this one this one also okay after that I have some lens flare go to place embedded option and I downloaded a huge lens flare over there and just hit ok and make it blending or crystallize this one and I'll take this lens flare and select the area of the lens flare and press ctrl J and keep this lens flare and delete this layer from the image and make it just select this layer this layer and by press the ctrl T and make the blending mode skin hit ok can move this uh, this one from here okay hit okay and go to the filter then blur and gaussian blur like that okay and after that go to the brightness and contrast option and make the brightness slowly down and after that go to the and decrease the brightness increase the contrast and hit ok and all the layer make a group and just you can move you can move all the group in the middle of the area and after that go to the color lookup and use the horror blue color lookup and reduce the opacity of the color lookup and make it the overlay options and after that I need to give the warm tone and here is a flare which is um, just making some noise okay fine I'll take another mm, uh, flare from my light collection go to the place embedded option and I'll go to light options which is the light collection and take this one make it skin by pressing ctrl T I will just rotate this one smaller and I'll 
just change the angle okay this one is ready and I need to give the warm tone and I'll go to the water filter and use the warm filter and after that I'll go to the gradient and I'll use the black gradient and make it linear to radial make it reverse and dirt also I'll give it 300% and it okay and I'll just keep these gradient to outside of the group and select the group and I'll just take this group in the middle okay in our flare there was a right tab over there and I will just make it crystallize and then go to the erase tool and just remove this one okay this one is our brush effect portrait and you can easily make your photo into in, into in this type of um, uh, creative brush effect portrait uh, it's too much easy and uh, thanks for watching my video tutorial if you want to get more tutorial from my channel you have to subscribe my channel and don't forget to share with your friend thank you so much